Hey guys, Jacob Z here from Jacob Z's Fish Aquariums. Uh, today I just put in my uh, leopard puffers into a 55 gallon aquarium. Um, we got it all set up with sand and everything and we'll, we put a little bit of oceanic salt. We have to slowly adjust them to uh, brackish water. Um, they are sold in the pet stores as freshwater fish and over time we have to slowly acclimate them to brackish water so they stay healthy and happy. Uh, typically they can live about 10 years in your aquarium in captivity. Um, some have been known to stay alive longer. Uh, right now these guys are about an inch, maybe inch and a half. Uh, they're really curious, I just let them go. Uh, there are three of them. So I just wanted to show you guys. Uh, and tell you a little bit about them. Uh, I guess I can tell you that uh, their food is right here. Uh, these are just regular snails. Um, I have a few of them dropped around. You can feed them clam on the half shell or snails. Um, they like blood worms for a treat and uh, you know uh, brine shrimp are a good treat as well but we want to keep them eating snails. Uh, they're gonna trim their teeth down uh, on the snail shells. Uh, they do eat the shell itself as well. Um, they're able to digest small bits of the shells. So He's got uh, quite a setup. I'm trying, we did put a bunch of leopard guppies in here with our leopard puffer fish. So we kind of themed it leopard fish. Um, we just got a few decorations in here, some extras that I had laying around. Um, we will uh, set it up a little differently. I just wanted to get them their home, get them set up. I've been waiting for these guys for quite a while. They're, they're one of my favorite fish. Um, and another reason why I keep guppies in here, um, typically the puffer fish will leave them alone. Uh, when a puffer fish eats a snail, they crush it and it makes a cloudy mess. And what these guppies do is they clean up all the particles that the pufferfish make. Uh, the pufferfish are very messy eaters, so they like to crush stuff and then spit it in and out. Um, as they get trained, they get more excited when you come up with food. Uh, they've been, they will, uh, you can hold the food up here at the top of the water, and they'll get so excited they'll spit water up at you to try to get you to let go of the food. Um, so, this is just, uh, the light settings is on night mode right now, um, but, well, I hope you guys enjoyed the, uh, 50 gallon, 55 gallon leopard pufferfish aquarium. Thanks for watching, guys.